Hi, this is Senator John Kerry. I'm really sorry that I can't be there with you in person tonight, but it's an honor for me to be able to join you long distance from the Senate. To Jim, Kenneth, Artemis, to the Spinal Muscular Atrophy Board, the New England Chapter of Families of SMA, and the National Board, thank you so much for having me, and thanks for all the terrific work that you're doing to support each other and to fight this illness. As you all know, this is the largest SMA conference anywhere in the world. And a gathering of this size is inspiring not just because so many of you are working together to find a treatment for SMA, but because you're making sure that in the meantime, no family has to go it alone. I know firsthand that when I was diagnosed with prostate cancer, one of the greatest comforts was in the way that I suddenly learned there were a whole bunch of kindred spirits out there people who had fought the same fight or were still fighting it, people who worried the same worries, who were there to answer my questions. Families of SMA does exactly that and a lot more. You fund the research that one day will stop the largest genetic killer of children under two. You press the case in the media and push it into the spotlight because more people need to know that while SMA is often talked about as a rare disease, it actually occurs in approximately one in 6,000 births, and one in 40 carry the recessive gene that causes SMA. That's hundreds of families here in Massachusetts and 25,000 across the country fighting the same battle that you are. The good news is there's reason to hope that that fight is about to get easier. The National Institute of Health has singled out SMA as the neurological disorder closest to treatment. And with Ted Kennedy and me in the Senate, you have partners who intend to do whatever we can to push them over the finish line. It starts with the SMA Treatment Acceleration Act, which I support to provide federal support to national nonprofits like yours to help you invest in the research that will hopefully turn SMA into a treatable disease. From helping to coordinate data to registering more patients, this bill does a great deal to empower scientists who today are closing in on effective treatment. This bill tells the scientists hunting for answers in the families of SMA that we're in your corner and we need to get this bill passed to make clear Congress is in your corner too. It sounds to me like you've got a terrific weekend ahead of you including, I understand, a trip to sacred ground, Fenway Park, home of, though some said it couldn't be done, the 2004 and 2007 world champion Boston Red Sox. So thank you to the SMA board, to your hosts tomorrow, the Red Sox, and everyone who is fighting this disease. You can absolutely always count on my help, but I want to thank you also for the tenacity with which you fight You've got my genuine gratitude and my respect. And now let's make sure we go out and let's pass this legislation. Let's do everything in our power to win this battle once and for all. Thank you and God bless.